Kiki Jeffrey. Oh, hey, Kiki. We met up because we were supposed to start collaborating and producing digital content mm -hmm. for this set company. And I just remember when Lauren introduced me to you, I immediately was like, oh, she's fierce. You know what I mean? Like, you just knew what you were talking about. And it's crazy to say, right? Because I think people assume, oh, entertainment industry, everybody knows what they're talking about. Sometimes people just be there and you be like, how do you, how do you been doing this job for so long? <laughs> so when I met you, I was just so blown away by just your professionalism and your innovative ideas. And so when we did have that dinner and I actually mentioned you the concept of Key TV, what was your first thought? Oh, I mean, even from that first conversation, Key, that you and I had with my work at Unbothered, you were on the phone with me and you said, we're it. We keep looking around for the people to do it. It's us. It's us. It's us. It's true. And when I tell you, I hear that ringing in my head all the time in the industry, we don't always get yeses. No, we and, mostly get no's. And people don't give us our coins, our credit, any of that. And for you to, within the first conversation, be like, it's us, it's us. Like, step into that light, step into that power was indescribable for me. <sighs> and so, just personally, it gave me the confidence to even go to that meeting and oh, say, man. I should be here. Like, yeah, of course I've been doing what I do and I've been doing it for black women for years and that's what I've been doing, you know, behind the scenes. Absolutely. But why not me? Why not you and me to build something with Nora that I know will hit? and that I know is really the next phase of what entertainment should be. Yes. And what culture should be. How would you describe what Key TV is? Ooh, I mean, number one, it's everything. <laughs> like, like, look at the material. <laughs> come on, girl. Like, it's a budget. You know, no, okay, come on. Come on. Come on, premium. Okay. It is genuinely like what I wish I had and what I think and I know everyone here now deserves and needs. And I think that is huge because to see it made is one thing, but to see it being created is an entirely different journey. And it's an entirely different type of magic. At Key TV, you're a key maker. Mm -hmm. That means that you're a visionary. You create the content that lives in this space, both scripted and unscripted. Mm -hmm. So talk to me about some of the shows you've created from Dear Kiki to Make It Make Sense. Yes, so Dear Kiki was actually born at that dinner what, that we were sitting at together. Because I was saying, Kiki, like, I need to hear your advice in surround sound. We were like, stop. <laughs> Let's write the whole one down. I have the literal iPhone note where I wrote down, Dear Kiki, okay, it's an advice show. And so Dear Kiki was born. And it's an advice show with, obviously, you, the one and only. Um, really just sharing thoughts and advice, we put out a line on your Instagram, and again, talk about the power of social. We got over 1,200 voicemails. That's so crazy and cool. Just with one single post, that is the power of what you do and people who listen to you too, Kiki. You better just recognize that. Ah. And they were so stunning. They And when we recorded them and when I was listening to them, people were spilling their tea, you know? <laughs> and I think that was something that was so stunning that we were like, oh, people are interested in this, but also people need this right now. We have conversations. You answer phone calls about love and relationships, about wellness, career, money, honey, okay? like. All Everything. All of it, because we're all, to be honest, going through it right now. And one of the things that I love about PTV is that we don't run away from hard conversations also. Yeah. Right? It's the ability to actually dig in, make them fun, make them compelling, but there's an element and of service. Make them make sense, sense. which is another exactly. one of these incredible IPs that you brought to the network where I love it because, so people are, you know, I got my little meme gags yes. going on, you know, and I love memes because the thing about memes is we all love them, but sometimes we don't talk about the reason as to why yes. we're all connecting on it. Like, yes. we'll see it. It's like, why do we all love this? Truly. And it's usually, like, something that's actually much deeper than what's on the surface. Like, we all use humor as a mm -hmm. disarmer to mm -hmm. what we're really feeling. Um, and so I love the concept of Make It Make Sense because that show gives us the opportunity to really break that down. Right. And I think, like, you know, when we think about our favorite memes or videos or trends, like, it's the blank for me. Like, but break it down. <laughs> break, it's the what for you. Yeah. Make it make sense. How did that come to you? Yes. How did you brainstorm? How, how do you brainstorm any of your ideas, actually? Oh, 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 it's concerning. Again, my iPhone notes are 
a mess. But I think like, honestly, what I really think about is like, what am I talking about in my group chats? What am I talking about mm. with my friends? What am I talking about with my sister? What's on my mind five minutes before I fall asleep? Those are the things that stay with me. And when I think about what a good idea is, it's one that stands up to that. If I ask it questions, if I'm like, okay, so if we're trying to make it make sense, what does this look like? Is it four people? Is it five? Yeah. What is the mix of opinions? How do we go back and forth? How do we like actually tear out and make sure that we're having real storytelling conversations? The ideas that stick with me and that I feel like I can't get out of my brain are the ones that I'm like, we gotta do something with this. We gotta yes. do something. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the conversation with one of our key makers. Be sure to check out more stories just like this and some of our other shows right here on Key TV.